Hey, um, I hope you're doing great today. I'm going to kind of go, since I've had some of this stuff out and everything, I'm going to go over how I get all this stuff in here and how I pack it um, after doing some research and stuff. Well, not research. I'm not going to call it that. After doing some reading on the internet, I've been carrying my food bag and stuff in the wrong place. I usually carry it, you know, on the top portion of my bag, but they recommend that you carry it kind of in the middle of the bag because um, it kind of helps, you know, support, you know, your back can kind of carry it a little bit better. So anyway, I've kind of changed the way I'm going to be in, and I've done this before on it, but um, it makes sense and I just have to catch myself on doing it. So the first thing that I usually do, or that I do, is I do throw my under quilts in the bottom. Now I don't use a stuff sack or anything like that. I put them in the bottom and they're compressible so um, and they're bulky. So by putting them in the bottom of it, everything, all my clothes and stuff and the weight will pack it down more. I do put everything inside a nylophone bag that I'm afraid that will get wet. So anyway, put everything in and then, you know, I'm going to go ahead and take my um, silk liner thing in it. So I'm going to push that in. So then after that, I put, um, this is my under quilt protector. I'm going to go ahead and put that over top of my under quilts and everything else. Now, other than that, my clothes is what goes in next and it kind of depends on the weather as far as what you know i'm gonna kind of leave out and what how i'm gonna pack it in but like if it was today it's about 65 degrees out today i would put every bit of this just pack it in on top of here so i've got both of my um um sleep pants and my sleep shirt i'm gonna pack that and each time that i put it in i'm just packing trying to press it down more to um make sure that it's getting compacted in here um next i'm gonna put my coat in put that in here now on top like i say i'll put my i'll probably put my gloves toward the top and um on top of the coat because if i had to put my coat on you know, I may have to have my gloves or something, so I'll put that on top. And then at last, on top of it all, because the first thing that I'll pull out probably when I get to camp will be my hammock, and I'll put that on top of everything else. Now, if it's a more chilly day, I'll put my coat and stuff on top of the hammock. It just depends on the weather conditions is how I do that. Now, doing this, I go ahead and I pack her down real good in here trying to get them under quilt and that top quilt packed in there and I take this nylon bag kind of get a lot of it and then I just take it and I turn that just to kind of get it to where it's not going to come loose and I fold it in back on itself just like in there. And I want to thank my wonderful and beautiful wife for um, helping me out with this. Um, then, now's when I'm going to go ahead and put my food bag and I've got my camp, my stove and everything inside the food bag. So I'm going to stick that in here on top of that. And see, it's kind of set in middle ways in my pack right here. It's kind of set in middle ways and around that and like i say it'll be fuller in this so i'm sure i'm gonna have to make some adjustments i've got my bathroom bag and everything and then my electronics that i've got here i'll put that bag in here i might put a pup in here since she wants to be nosy i've got my gloves thing now all that stuff kind of real quick to get i just store this in the front um my tarp stakes uh, it's just some mini groundhogs they work wonderful put that here in the front i've got my um tree straps and stuff that goes in here 
my um, rain cover right there, my um, bear bag line, don't forget. And that's another thing while we're talking, make sure, you, I've left camp before and not check, make sure you check camp and make sure you've got everything before you leave. Um, that's one thing, if I get in a hurry or something, I'll forget to do and I'm gonna have to make sure that I'm adamant to do that on it. And then I've got my rain kilt. I'll stuff in here my fuel bottle keep it right there of course now I do keep my rain jacket on the outside of my pack and I just stuff it in my front pocket here now once that's in my wind pants I just stuff them in somewhere I just try to run it down the side of the bag and then on my tarp I basically just um, take it and stick it right here right beside my umbrella and um, it rides pretty good right there and I just kind of cinch it down a little bit and of course I got my little sit pad pad and I'm just going to put it right here and I just put that over top of my pack. I don't have the lid. I don't have a lid or anything on my pack. And basically that acts as a rain deterrent also on it. So that kind of goes over top. And that's how I pack my pack.